We are joined by none other than the offlaner of Team Liquid, Boxy. How are you doing, my friend? Nice, uh, nice W. Congrats. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, you're yep. good. All right. All is good. Yeah. No, I'm doing very well. Obviously, I'm really happy we won against OG. Um, I wanted to say that I think we, or this game I played, I feel like I played mid most of the time. So I don't, I don't think it's fair to say that it's like you put me in the offlane, that I'm the offlaner of Liquid. I feel like yeah, I was sure. mid most of the game. I, think, I see. I think Max is also like, you know, most of the time mid. He played carry this game. I think Max was maybe the carry of this game. So what would that make Mickey? I mean, Mickey was probably the offlaner this game, I think. I think you should be a little bit careful about how you label us as well. I think you should apologize, Kyle. I'm sorry, Boxy, to do you such an egregious insult. Yep. Do you feel like you're not getting uh, enough credit in Team Liquid? Is that it? You know, relegated <laughs> no, to the no, three? No. Do you see yourself as more of the one? I think that some people might um, take offense by what you have to say on the panel, Kyle. And that's... So I'm assuming roles in 2020, man. It's, it's really disgusting of you, Carl. No. Really disgusting, honestly. <laughs> well, did, no, Aiden it was, didn't. It was some good games. It was some good games. Sorry, Carl, I'm just messing with you. Uh -huh. <laughs> Aiden didn't make it hard enough for me yesterday. You want to double down. I see how it is. I appreciate it. <laughs> uh, what's it like for you uh, playing from home? Do you feel more confident and comfortable behind the screen? Because, uh, you know, you do tend to choke a little bit on land sometimes. Um, I think it's actually the reverse. I feel like I choke less on land than I do online. Everyone's obviously entitled to their own opinion, but I think that playing online, it, it's gotten better over the last couple of weeks. We've been putting a lot of work on making sure that we're focused, but at least for me personally, it's been harder to put in the same amount of work and energy because like, the feeling of competition is maybe not really the same. Mm. Um, so like just work, work, um, work ethic, both outside, like, the outside the tournaments, your scrims and stuff have been like, harder maybe to keep up with in a proper way. Yeah, understandable. But I think uh, the, I can say like the games now is finally starting to feel, at least for me, it's like more hype. We're all like clicking more, so that's very good. I good. I mean, you did just take down Secret and OG, two of the best teams arguably in the world. Uh, looking forwards, uh, who do you see as your hardest competition remaining? Because you vanquished uh, effectively everyone that stood against you. I think we have a like this ability to always beat whatever team as long as we're maybe not secret i mean we just did as long as we're playing well i think it's a lot of times just like up to us how well we perform and what form we're in i think the last couple of days have been really really amazing for like our atmosphere and our teamwork and usually we keep building up building onto that in tournaments so i wouldn't say that i'm like specifically scared of any team i think like secret of course is a really big opponent but i think like any of the teams that we're playing could like, could be us. I also see us beating everyone right now. So, not really scared of anything in specific. Uh, cool. uh, I have a question. Like, Boxy, in the first phases of the tournament, your form as individuals, to me, it looked really good, though you seemed kind of disconnected as a team. What has changed now so that you are actually destroying the best teams in the world? I think we probably got better at syncing, like, our sleep schedules so we ended up playing more pubs together i'm not even kidding like a lot of times i would wake up when like tommy went to bed or vice versa so i think it's very important to keep practicing together and not only alone um but i mean it's just it just comes with winning like winning is fun and it makes you want to play more and play better and it's like a positive cycle i think okay so outside of that you said earlier that you just started to click now like what do you think is that thing that like makes you click because i see your drafts maybe uh, changing up a bit in style or something like what what is that factor online as a team that differentiates your start to now in this tournament do you think i think it's just hard work i think our mm -hmm. drafts have been really really good mm -hmm. um yep. but i think a lot of the times our drafts are really really good and that doesn't really make us click i think that we have been putting in a lot of work into scrims and tournaments and reviewing our replays and like not really been slacking i wouldn't say that we've been slacking but i think we've mm -hmm. been like stepping it up energy wise and putting putting in the work even though it's hard to do yeah. it online, I think, for me. And yeah. I think it's just showing results. And yeah, it's it is. everyone like working hard, basically. Cool. I will uh, say, uh, of all teams in Dota, you guys do seem to be the most up and down based on your work ethic uh, from my experience hanging out with you guys. Uh, the final question is, you guys have this awesome partnership with Marvel, sick uniforms. What superhero are you? And who do you think your teammates are? Oh boy, um, I'm, I would say, I don't know if it's a superhero, I would say I'm a bit like Iron Man, like Tony Stark, 
because um, maybe people don't always know where they have me or if they can like <laughs> control me, I guess. Gotcha. And then Sacrificial. I think Koi Koi is definitely Captain America, 100%. <laughs> Just like, save, save the team. I'm going in. He's like a tank with a shield. Um, I don't know. Aiden is probably the... Oh, what's his name? The guy Ant that floats? No, Benedict Cumber, Cucumber Batch. Doctor what's Strange. That's pretty accurate. Yes, thank you. I can see I that. Think Aiden is definitely Doctor Strange. Mm -hmm. It's like a good guy, but with like mysterious powers. Okay. Um, have you put a lot yeah, of thought into know. this? Or is this all off the top? We, we did the have this conversation. We had this conversation a couple of weeks ago, I think, within the team. <laughs> gotcha. I, I, Tommy and Mickey, I don't know. Tommy is like Hawkeye. <laughs> Tommy is Hawkeye. And then Mickey is, I don't know, some fucking ball. What's the uh, Captain Marvel, probably? But uh, like, uh, I guess not. he's not a girl in the scenario. But I mean, this is Captain Marvel. Pretty awesome and strong and like powerful. Kills everyone. <laughs> Got it. All right. Well, that was a much better answer than I expected. <laughs> Thank you very much, Boxy. Congrats on the win. And uh, hope to see you guys soon. And good luck further in the tournament. All right. Thank you very much, guys. It's uh, fun to talk to you. Oh, you too, buddy. Have a good one.